There remaineth no more pertaining unto the Senate and the people than the 24th order, whereby it is lawful for the province of Marpesia to have 30 knights of their own election continually present in the Senate of Oceana, together with 60 deputies of horse and 120 of foot in the prerogative tribe, endowed with equal power, respect, uh, respect had unto their quality and number in the debate and result of this commonwealth, provided that they observe the course or rotation of the same by the annual return of ten knights, twenty deputies of the horse, and forty of the foot. The like in all respects is lawful for Panopea, and the horse of both the provinces amounting unto one troop, and the foot unto one company, one captain, and one cornet of the horse shall be annually chosen by Marpesia, and one captain and one ensign of the foot shall be annually chosen by Panopea. The orb of the prerogative, being thus complete, is not unnaturally compared unto that of the moon, either in consideration of the light borrowed from the senate as from the sun, or of the ebbs and floods of the people, which are marked by the negative or affirmative of this tribe, and the constitution of the Senate and the people being shown, being shown, you have that of the Parliament of Oceana, consisting of the Senate proposing and the people resolving, which amounts unto an act of Parliament. So the Parliament is the heart which, consisting of two ventricles, the one greater and replenished with, the grosser store, with a grosser store, the other less and full of a pure, uh, sucketh in and gusheth forth the lifeblood of Oceana by a perpetual circulation. Wherefore the life of this government is no more unnatural or obnoxious for this unto dissolution than that of a man, nor unto giddiness than the world, seeing the earth, whether it be itself or the heavens that are in rotation, is so far from being giddy that it could not subsist without the motion. But why should not this government be much rather capable of duration and steadiness by a motion than which God hath ordained no other unto the universal commonwealth of mankind, seeing one generation cometh and another goeth, but the earth remaineth firm forever, that is, in her proper situation or place, whether she be moved or not moved upon her proper center. The Senate, the people, and the magistracy, or the parliament so constituted, as you have seen, is the guardian of this commonwealth, and the husband of such a wife, as is elegantly described by Solomon. She is like a merchant's ship, she bringeth her food from afar, from far, she considereth a field, and buyeth, and buyeth it. With the fruit of her hand she planteth a vineyard, she conceiveth that her merchandise is good she stretches forth her hands to the poor she is not afraid of the snow for her household for all her household are clothed with scarlet her she maketh herself coverings of her tapestry her clothing is silk and purple her husband is known by his robes in the gates where he sitteth amongst the senators of the land the gates or the inferior courts or branches as it were of the sanhedrim or senate of israel nor is our commonwealth a worse housewife, or hath she less regard unto her magistrates, as may appear by the twenty-fifth order, that whereas the public revenue is through the late civil wars dilapidated, the excise being improved or improvable to the revenue of one million, be applied for the space of eleven years to come unto the uh, reparation of the same and the present maintenance of the magistrates, knights, deputies, and other officers, who, according unto their several dignities and functions, shall annually re receive towards the support of the same, as followeth. The Lord Strategus marching is upon another account to have field pay as general. The Lord Strategus sitting, 2,000 pounds per annum. The Lord Orator, 2,000 pounds per annum. The three commissioners of the seal, four thousand five hundred pounds per annum. The three commissioners of the treasury, four thousand five hundred pounds per annum. The two censors, three thousand pounds per annum. The two hundred ninety knights, at five hundred pounds a man, one hundred forty-five 
thousand pounds per annum. The four ambassadors in ordinary, twelve thousand pounds per annum. The council of war for intelligence, three thousand pounds per annum. The master of the ceremonies, five hundred pounds per annum. The master of the horse, five hundred pounds per annum. His substitute, five hundred pounds per annum. The twelve valentines uh, for their win winter liveries, two hundred forty pounds per annum. For their summer liveries, a hundred and twenty pounds per annum. For their board wages, four hundred and eighty pounds per annum. For the keeping of three coaches of state, twenty-four coach horses with coachmen and postilions, one thousand five hundred pounds per annum. For the groom and keeping of sixteen great horses, for the master of the horse and for the ballotines who whom he is to govern and instruct in the art of writing, four hundred and eighty pounds per annum. The twenty secretaries of the parliament, two thousand pounds per annum. The twenty doorkeepers who are to attend with pole axes for their coats, two hundred pounds per annum. For their board wages, one thousand pounds per annum. The twenty messengers, which are trumpeters, for their coats, two hundred pounds per annum. For their board wages, one thousand pounds per annum. For ornament of the musters of the youth, five hundred pounds or five thousand pounds per annum. Some. One thousand eight, one thousand eighty nine thousand, one hundred eighty nine thousand three hundred and seventy pounds per annum. Out of the personal estates of every man who is, who at his death bequeatheth, not above forty shillings unto the muster of that hundred, wherein he it lies, shall be levied one per cent. Until the solid revenue unto the muster of the hundred amount unto fifty pounds per annum. For the prizes of the youth, the twelve ballotines, for are are to be divided into three regions according unto the course of the Senate. The four of the first region to be elected at the tropic out of the, such children as the knights of the same shall offer, not being under eleven years of age nor above eight above thirteen, and their election shall be made by the lot at an urn set by the sergeant of the horse for the purpose in the hall of the pantheon, the livery of the commonwealth for the fashion of the color, the livery of the commonwealth for the fashion of, or the color, may be changed at the election of the strategus according unto his fancy. But every knight during his session shall be bound to give unto his footman or some one of his footmen the livery of the commonwealth. The prerogative tribe shall receive as followeth the two tribunes of the horse, fourteen pounds by the week, the two tribunes of the foot, twelve pounds by the week, the three captains of the foot of the horse, three captains of the horse, fifteen pounds by the week, the three cornets, nine pounds by the week, the three captains of foot, twelve pounds by the week, the three ensigns, seven pounds by the week, the four hundred and forty two horse at two pounds a man, 884 pound, uh, pounds by the week. The 592 foot at one pound 10 squid, uh, at man, 800 and eight, 888 pounds by the week. The six trumpeters, seven to 10, and the three drummers, two to five. Some by the week, 1,850. Some by the year, 96,239. The total of the Senate of the people, the total of the Senate, the people, and the magistracy, 287,400. 59. The dignity of the commonwealth and aids of the several magistracies and offices thereunto belonging being provided for as aforesaid, the overplus of the excise with the product of the sum arising shall be carefully managed by the senate and the people through the diligence of the officers of the, F of the exchequer till it amount unto eight millions or to the purchase of about four hundred thousand pounds solid revenue at which time the term of eleven years being expired the excise except if it be otherwise ordered by the senate and the people shall be totally remit remitted 
and abolished forever.